Hi there, Mrs. Elke here. Today, Olivia wanted to do a self-portrait in cartoon. So we made cartoon Olivia. So if you'd like to learn how to do a cartoon girl, you can put your own spin on it, maybe change the hair a little bit, or change the outfit to make it all your own. We'll be so excited to see what you come up with. This is Olivia saying hello. So fun. All right, and enjoy, and can't wait to see what you make as well. Thanks for watching. To start off our cartoon Olivia's, we're going to draw a U pretty big on the top part of our page. This is how I start making any cartoon character. So see if you can start right about here and make a U in the middle of your page and have it end right about there, okay? Nice big U. Okay, at the top of our U, we're gonna make a line like this. So you actually might wanna make your U a little bit higher. Like that, there, and then you can now go ahead and do a line maybe that starts right about there. Good, and then I'm gonna make a curved line that goes on the very top. This is for the hair. Good, and it's gonna come down to as long as you want your hair to be. So maybe right about there is where your hair is right now, right? Good, now we're gonna make a really skinny little neck that goes down from the top. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna make a curve line to connect my neck together. Can you make a curve line to connect it? Good. Now, Olivia, do you want to wear a dress or a shirt? A dress. Okay, so for a dress, I'm going to start at my curved line and I'm going to make a line that goes almost to the bottom, but not quite, on both sides. Like that. And then I'm going to make a slightly curved line to connect it. Okay. Do you want any kind of design on your dress? Yeah, hold a sunflower. A sunflower. All right, so I'll do a middle circle for the sunflower, and then sunflowers have small petals that go around it. So I'm going to add a nice little sunflower. It almost looks like a sun. And then I'll add the stem with a couple of leaves my cute little sunflower. Oh, you're doing three sunflowers, fancy. All right, I'm gonna jump up to the face now. And for the eyes, instead of doing them really high, I actually go pretty low with the eyes and pretty wide. So I'm gonna make black circles that are pretty far down on the face. Make some black circles for the eyes. And then for my nose, I just make a, a real little U like that. That looks like a smile. Mm -hmm, it does. Well, the smile is going to be bigger. For the smile, you can do a line, or if you want to, you can widen it a little bit so her mouth looks a little bit open like that. And color it in. Good. All right, do you want to be holding anything in your picture, Olivia? Mm. Nope, just hands down by your side? Or maybe saying hello? Here, we'll make one hand saying hello. I'm going to start my hands on the side like this, and then I'm going to have it go up like that. So down and up for the arm. Mm -hmm. And then make another one underneath. Down and up to match it. Good. And then you can make fingers. One, two, three, four, five. Good. And then the other hand is just going to be down by her side. So I'm just going to go like that. Good. And then for the feet, I start with a line in the middle and then two lines on either side that aren't quite as long. So it's 
three lines total. And you might not have enough space to do the feet. We'll see. I make the side lines here that so it looks kind of like an L going two ways and then connect them up to the side like that to make feet. Yep, and you'll probably just have to do it down because you're kind of low on room. Yep. Okay, now we got to finish the hair. So the hair is going to just go out a little bit and then curve back in. Out a little bit and curve back in. Like that. Yep, and then of course we color. Okay, so we've got the girl there. Oh, do you want a bow in your hair? Mm -hmm. You can put a little bow in your hair too. And then we can color it in. Cartoon Olivia. And Olivia has kind of golden color hair, so I'm gonna start with the hair. Make it yellow. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, pretty close. We're both pretty blonde, huh? My this color is like Goldilocks, yeah. Like Goldilocks? Mm -hmm. Do you like the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Do you think Goldilocks was good or bad in the story? Well, bad. Yeah, right? Didn't she go into their house without being invited? And then she ate the porridge. Yeah, and broke baby's chair. And she broke the chair. And he played. And she slept in the bed. That Goldilocks. Yeah. I wouldn't want her in my house breaking my yeah, stuff but, and eating my but, food. Mama, put good her chair and I think back. Because I'll bring her over to my birthday party. Oh, yeah, you're thinking of the book where she says, I'm sorry, I'll invite you to my birthday party. That's the postman book. That's a good one. All right, well, we're gonna keep on coloring these and making them so beautiful. Yeah. The only other thing I'm going to add to mine, and I like to do this on a lot of the people that I um, make when I'm making cartoons, is I like to add some rosy cheeks. So I add just a hint of pink, kind of right where the cheeks are. And that kind of helps bring the face to life a little bit. Regarding, regardless of the skin color, the skin tone, if it's darker or lighter, I always like to add a little bit of rosiness to the cheeks. So it makes it kind of come, come to life. Yep. A little bit rosy. You can see we've decorated our dresses. You still got to work on those flowers. I'm excited to see how you're going to color those. I might make a little bit more detail on my hair. While you're doing that, I like to darken the hair a little bit right by the neck so it looks like the neck is in front and the hair is in the back. So I'm just darkening this a little bit and then it'll kind of get lighter as it goes farther out. Are you going to do the middle or something? Or no? Leave it white. Mm, the boys don't like purple yeah. and pink, do they? What about your bow? Are you going to do anything with your bow? Or the middle of your flowers? Okay. Sounds like a plan. Well, we hope that you enjoyed making a cartoon girl. We'll have to do another one making a cartoon boy sometimes. You can see how I do those. It's actually very similar, just with different hair um, and obviously different clothes. All right, pretty good. Thanks so much for watching. 
please like our videos and subscribe below if you would like to see more of our fun art. All right, thank you.